Hello and welcome! Today we're looking at Towers, an open world farming and crafting survival sim set in a world straight out of our wildest dreams. Obviously, the style is gorgeous, the world is inviting, and the game looks just plain fun, so let's jump right in. Towers takes place on this huge island. It apparently takes 30 minutes to get from one side to the other. Uh, something happened here that drove your ancestors away, and so now you're coming back to trying to take the island and build your civilization back up. When you first start, you choose where you're gonna build your tower, and the tower doesn't move from there, but then it's up to you to gather the resources you need to build up your camp into eventually this like kind of city or town. But here's where it really gets interesting. This is what I'm excited for, the simulated ecosystems. So in order to get fish, you first have to start planting like seaweeds and stuff that fish will want to live around. And then once the fish are there, you can start fishing. But the same goes for other animals. If you wanna get these like cows things, then you have to plant trees and grass that the cows want to eat. And then when they show up, you can you can take them. But then when you cut down those trees, they stop showing up. So as much as it's about crafting and farming, it's even more about balancing your impact upon the environment of the island. And the most exciting thing for me, I think, is the multiplayer. We'll all get to live on this island. Um, apparently we get to have 20 people on an island, but we're not competing. It's all mostly collaborative. Uh, you can work together to harvest stuff or you can just trade. And eventually you can set up trade routes between your towers and other people's towers. But that isn't to say we won't have our fair share of combat. It could be with animals on the island, which range from just like herding animals to these giant monsters that you you can actually farm on and you can ride them all, but there's also a demonic presence on the island and throughout the game, it's slowly getting stronger. So these enemies are getting stronger and you have to fight them and protect your stuff from them. That looks awesome. And speaking of which, those demons, they're kind of like the meta game. So each server, which is an island, has this timer attached to it and you have two outcomes. One of them, there are these secret conditions that the island has to meet in order for it to win. And I don't know exactly what that looks like. I assume it's like achieving some kind of harmony on the island between your city and the environment around you. And it creates this Eden, we can only assume. Uh, but the other outcome is that the demons become too strong and they take over all the towns, they destroy the island, and they destroy the server. And I, I kind of have an idea of what that might look like. <laughs> Let me just say, I am here for it. We don't have a release date yet. It's still way early in the development cycle and it's being made by a super small team, but keep your eyes out, keep your ears open because eventually they're gonna have some kind of beta test. Who knows? Check out all their socials, check out their website, and uh, you know what? Have a good day, wash your hands.